Let's take a look at network interfaces, which are software or hardware interfaces between two pieces of equipment or protocol layers in a computer network. And so network interface controllers, also known as NICs, um, that is the actual piece of hardware that uh, connects computer to computer network. And they go by a bunch of different names, such as network interface card, network adapter, LAN adapter, physical network interface, or even uh, ethernet interface controller card. So if it was back in the 1990s, you definitely would have had one of these in the back of your computer. And if you're a gamer uh, today, then you have one because you want that wired connection. So you have a super fast connection. Uh, and so um, these cards or NICs uh, communicate using the internet protocol, also known IP. That's going to allow them to uh, communicate on the on layer two, the data link layer, and the physical layer of the OSI uh, model. Uh, and so the way these work in Azure is they're called the Azure Network Interfaces, and um, they have the same uh, initialism and IC. And so the idea is that you're gonna attach a network interface uh, to an Azure uh, VM instance. And without one of these, your Azure VM just can't communicate because it's just, imagine not having that card in your computer. It would have no way of, of communicating. Uh, and the difference here is that they're just virtual network interfaces, right? So I'm sure um, at the data center, Azure has a bunch of these um, actual uh, cards, but they are abstracted away. So, you know, you just treat them as virtual. And um, an Azure VM instance has to have at least one NIC, but it can also have uh, multiple NICs if you want. And so here's just a nice little graphical representation of a VM that has a NIC attached to it. So there you go.